Centurion, this is Detective Burial. I'm Detective Polsky. Who left that on you? Take it off. It just looks stupid. Well, I didn't know I was supposed to. It just looks stupid. Yes. Like I was saying, this is Detective Burial. I'm Detective Polsky. Well, the first thing I'd like to say is that I have complete respect for you and for what you do, and that I'll be glad to help you in any way I can. I have complete respect. Well, that's good to hear. I'm not like one of these. The only duty of a storyteller is to tell a story. Yeah, it might have been. I, yeah, the only duty of a storyteller is to tell a story. And it, that's what I do. I tell stories. No acts to grind, no political anything to grind whatsoever. And that's why I can't see why you brought me in here. I can't see why I would be here unless something political came in or something that seemed political came in. In which case, show me where it is. Show me where the little bastard is and I'll cut it out. Fucking burn it, you know? You know what I mean? I have to fill this form out now. It's a form in case anything bad happens to you in custody. We have a mistake here, I think, with your name. Your surname is Katurian, yes? Yes. Ah, see, we've got your first name as Katurian. My first name is Katurian. Your first name is Katurian. Yes. And your second name is Katurian? Yes. Your name is Katurian Katurian. My parents were fun people. Hmm. Middle initial? Okay. <laughs> Your name is Katurian, Katurian, Katurian. Like I said, my parents were funny people. Hmm. For funny, I guess we're the stupid fucking idiots. You know, I'm not a stupid idiot. Your home address is Kevin East 4443? Yes. Which you share with your... My brother, Michael. Oh, Michael. At least it's not fucking Katurian. Brother, he's backwards. Yeah. No, it's not backwards. He's a little slow to get things sometimes. Oh, okay. He's slow to get things. Next to Ken? My brother, my... What? Next to Ken? Just formalities. Katurian. 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 You know what I mean. Place of work. The County Slaughterhouse. Oh, this writer. That's not so bad. You like to work there? No. It's not so bad. Cutting up animals. I wasn't a form in case anything bad happens to you in custody. I was just mucking around. And what was it? It was a piece of paper I was about to tear in two. Ah, here we are. The little apple mint. Alright, what about it? It's not my best story, but it's pretty good though. This is a story that starts off, there's this little girl and her father treats her badly. Yeah, he slaps her around, isn't that? He's a bad You seem to have a lot of story. He's a what? What? The father. He's a something, you said. He represents something, does he? Well, he represents a bad father. He is a bad father. What, what do you mean, represents? He is a bad father. Yes. He slaps a little girl around. This is why he's a bad father? Yes. What else does he do to the little girl? He is a bad father. I believe all that the story says is that he treats the little girl badly. You can draw your own conclusions. Oh, we can draw our own conclusions now, can we? Yeah. You are telling us that we can draw our own fucking conclusions no, no, no. now, are you? Yes, no. Um, we know we can draw our own fucking conclusions. I know. What? I know. Fucking what? What? Uh, Ariel's getting a bit aggrieved because we can draw our own conclusions is sort of our job. And the first conclusion we're drawing is exactly how many stories have you got a little girl is treated badly or a little boy is treated badly. You? A few. I'll say a fucking few. The first fucking 20 we read were a little boy gets fucked over in this way, or a little girl gets fucked over in that way. Yeah, but 
that's not saying anything. I'm not trying to say You're it. not what? What? Not what? What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that the children I, represent something? I'm trying to say. That, like the children represent the people or something. I'm trying to say he's putting words into my fucking mouth now. I'm trying to say you let me draw my own fucking No, you just did it. Oh, we can't even speak now! This fucking oh. man said, put your fucking hands down! Anytime you're ready, Ariel. Retake your seat, please. Oh, I almost forgot to mention, I'm the good cop, he's the bad cop. So, back to literature. The father, as we've established, treats the little girl badly. And one day, the little girl gets some apples, and she carves little men out of these apples, all little fingers, little eyes, little toes. If I ever leave this world alive, well, thank you for the things you did in my life. If I ever leave this world alive, I'll come back down and sit beside your feet tonight. Where 